There we go. Fish on. What's up guys, this is Tony with Salt Strong and I want to talk about when to use a topwater lure versus a subsurface hard bait. Now both of these lures can be very ideal under very similar conditions. However, when it comes down to how the fish are responding to your lures, that will really decide which one would be best and also uh, the time of day as well. So the two lures that I have here, this is our Moonwalker topwater lure, which we sell on our shop page at fishstrong.com. And then also our new Skinny Lipper, which is a hard body jerk bait. It's a floating jerk bait that dives down anywhere from about 14 to 16 inches below the surface and then floats back up when you stop your retrieve. So an ideal lure to use in the shallows. Again, both of these can be picked up at fishstrong.com and if you're one of our insider members, keep in mind that you do get a discount on all tackle and gear. So definitely be sure to take advantage of that. So now as far as which lure to use when. Usually first thing in the morning, I'm gonna start out with a topwater lure, especially in the warmer months, you know, spring, summer, and early fall. Topwater can be ideal under overcast conditions, low light conditions, because those fish are feeding up to the surface, so they don't want that sunlight in their eyes. Now, the biggest thing is whenever you find that the fish are striking short, or you're really just not getting any strikes or blow ups on top water, that's when I would switch over to something a little bit more subsurface that those fish will commit to. So again, if you see you know, the fish coming up and popping at the lure, not really committing to it, or you see them follow but not strike, that's when I would go with something subsurface, such as a hard body jerk bait, such as the skinny lipper here. Now another situation in where I would go with the subsurface jerk bait is going to be you know obviously later in the morning when the sun gets higher you know those fish really aren't going to go after top water that's when i would switch to something subsurface because again those fish aren't going to be as willing to strike up at the surface as they would be early in the morning when the light is a little lower so this is something you can throw all day and even in the morning uh, you know you don't necessarily always have to use a top water in the morning Something that is subsurface just below the surface can definitely get the job done. Now, even though lures are obviously very important when it comes to actually hooking in a fish and catching fish, what's most important and I feel a lot of people have an issue with is consistently getting into the right spots at the right time. You know, a lot of people I see go to the same spots over and over again. They might have a good day uh, one day and then the next trip it's a complete bust and that's because fish move based on various conditions when it comes to inshore fishing you know shallow water weather is a big factor uh, tides are a big factor and all sorts of variables come into play that will determine where those fish are going to move to and where the best productive feeding zones are going to be so if you're having trouble consistently catching fish highly recommend checking out our salt strong insider club at saltstrong.com where we guarantee you'll start catching more inshore fish in less time so that will wrap up this video again if you need any of these lures we sell them on our shop page at fishstrong.com you can pick them up there and if you have any additional questions or comments or any tips you would like to share when it comes to using topwater lures or subsurface jerk baits, definitely let us know in the comments down below. Until next time, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next video.